Mario. Hello. Greetings, gamer girls. I'm Celsty, also knows Cold Clocks and the Nintendo. Welcome to Super Mario 64 The Missing Stars. Wait, Clona, you already played this game. Yes, I have. But, apparently, I guess if you guys forgot, if you press uh, left on the D pad, uh, you can you actually get to play as Luigi. It doesn't really affect it, and I think that's and that's basically what this is. We are going to be playing Super Luigi 64: The Missing Stars. That that's that's really all there is to it. We're just going to be playing the entire game as Luigi. Now, from what I understand, I don't really think there are any significant differences between Mario and Luigi, except. For some reason, Luigi's uh, voice is deeper than Mario's is. Um, you think it'd be higher, but it's not. But anyways, before first and foremost, what we're gonna do is um, we are going to uh, we are going to um, start by getting the wing cap and the metal cap. Now, in case you guys uh, didn't watch uh, Super Mario, Super Mario Six. Super Mario 64 The Missing Stars, I will be explaining what you're supposed to do in this game as well. So basically, uh, there is no vanish cap in this game. It, there's only the wing cap and the metal cap. And, and to, and to uh, get the wing cap, what you gotta do is you gotta jump over those mushrooms and get onto this elevator right here. Oh, what? Pfft. That's what I get for not paying attention. Okay. Now we're in this pipe is where you get the uh, wing cat, and for some reason, well, there is a um, star in this block, but for some reason I like to get that one last. <laughs> Jeez. Now I. Don't exactly remember where we got. Oh yeah, I think it's over here we gotta go. Like I said, uh, yeah, to get the uh, wing to the uh, metal cap, you gotta go in here. Then you gotta step on this mushroom. Well, and then you gotta uh, step on this. And that's all I really wanted to do in this, um, in this, uh, in this, uh, part. So I think we're going to end it here. Next time on, uh, actually, wait, let's not yet. Let's go in here. Alright, actually, hold on. Let's do the camera. Is there a shy guy in here? I'm hiding from the Goombas outside. They look quite angry. Okay. During the day, I didn't even know these, that that guy was here. During the day, there's someone different though. Yeah, basically, if you enter and exit the map a certain amount of times, it will actually turn from day to night, which I think is pretty clever. Peaceful in here, isn't it? Sometimes during the day I hear noises coming from the roof as someone's walking up there.
The Mystic Stars be one level by Messaham, aka Frobber, thanks to the people who contributed to this hack. Salix, Secret Woods level and major help on the underground area. RDX, some music ports made with MM MML2 and M64. VL Toe, Luigi model, as available from Toadstool 64 version 0.5.9 onwards. Dark Data, title screen background and name suggestion. Kosteki, correcting some text. Stevo is at beta testing. ZZ Top 32. A pretty cool guy who helped me work working with MIPS GCC. Thanks also to Cellar Dweller, Yoshi F Electron, Vigor, Viper, and Art Restore for sharing their notes and findings. Check out my YouTube channel, user Robert, for more information about upcoming tab and Super Mario 64 tools. Thanks for playing. You're welcome. I really wish the camera wasn't terrible. Anyways, guys. I think we're going to end it here. Uh, so next time on Super Mario 64, The Mystic Stars, we are going to, uh, we are going to, uh, uh, start working on The Missing Stars. I will see you guys next time. As always, remember to smile. You are the face of Full Bucks and the Night Game. Goodbye.